UFC fighter workouts are certainly fan friendly, and many of those fans showed up to see their favorite fighter today, whether it was Connor, Nate, Holly, or Misha. Each one had something to say. Come in, man, main event, first fight of the night, I don't care. Our fight wouldn't be getting as much publicity if it wasn't for Connor anyways. There's not a lot of secrets to reveal. The fighters put on a show, shared a few thoughts, and fired up the fans. He's going to say this and say that, but now all of a sudden he's a scared little brother of some sort. Coming to fight, and uh, it, it is what it is. I sense it differently. I think it's clear as day. He's not himself, you know what I mean? He's timid, his voice is quivering. Nate's workout was more of a 10 minute walkout. Uh, he didn't want the fight at 170. We just, it just ended up at 170. I hunted him down, stalked him, got him. And now I have him trapped on Saturday night. And that fight's going to be an amazing fight, something I'm really looking forward to. Connor's an exciting fighter. Holly Holmes' first major appearance since knocking out Ronda Rousey wasn't all that rousing. And right now, I have Misha in front of me, so I'm focusing on that. Um, I'm glad that fans want to see things because that's why they're in the stands. Misha Tate worked out for 20 minutes but dreamed of much more. Because I've envisioned this fight so many different ways. Like, I've, I've envisioned myself knocking her out. I've envisioned myself, like, kicking her to the body and finishing her. I mean, I've, I've envisioned the craziest things, and the only common denominator is that I'm always the winner. While everybody showed up, it was Connor who worked up a legit sweat, working out while getting worked up for Saturday's showdown. Look at this. This is always history. Every damn time, the gates keep rising, the pay-per-views keep rising, the attendance keep, you know what I mean? Everything just keeps on rising, so it's always history-making here when I step in, in inside that octagon. And it's always a lot of fun. Somewhat surprising, however, lots of tickets still remain for Saturday's fight. Now